Crawler vs Canva, which is a better designing tool in 2021. Hi guys, today I am comparing Crawler with Canva and we'll figure out which one of these platform is a better online designing tool for you to use in 2021. So let's get started. Now we all know about Canva and when it comes to designing and video editing, we consider Canva right away because we're like, okay, Canva is easy to use and it's kind of like famous. But most of the people don't know about Crello. Crello is an other alternative for Canva which allows you to create amazing designs online in 2021. The sign-up process is completely free and as in the Canva as well, the sign-up process on Canva is completely free as well. Now, I am not favoring any of the website. I'll just compare these two and we will be comparing their features and pricing and we'll figure out then how these platforms actually differ from each other and what are different features that one offers and the other does not. So before we check out their features, let's go to their pricing and figure out whether they are affordable or not. So let's check out the pricing for Crello first. You can see right here, the starter plan is $0 and it allows you to have five designs download every month, 50K plus static and animated graphic designing templates, 1 million plus free premium images, thousands of full HD video clips, instant access to 200 million plus royalty free stocks. And then there is a pro plan, which is $7.99 per month. And it has all of these amazing features as well. 50K plus static, 1 million plus free premium images in YT members easily create branded content with brand kits remove background from the images so it's very cheap guys if we talk about Crello. Let's go to Canva. You can see the free plan of Canva is given right here. Now the free plan of Canva is pretty amazing. It allows you to have 2 million plus free templates, 100 plus design types, social media posts, presentation letters and more, hundreds of thousands of free photos and graphics, invite members to your team, collaborate and comment in real time and 5 GB of cloud storage. And when we talk about the pro plan which is $119 per month, it allows you to have everything that a free Free plan has 100 plus million premiums, 6 million plus premium and free templates, easily save, remove image background, resize design, save designs, 100 GB of cloud storage and much more. And then there is an enterprise which will have a customized pricing as your features will be customized as well. So this is the pricing for Canva. Now if we check out Crello is kind of like very cheaper from Canva but on Canva you can actually do video editing and other things as well and when we talk about the free templates and free designs canva is actually giving you a lot in these plans and in the free plan as well so that's a good difference between these two crello is kind of like cheaper if you look at the price it's eight dollars uh, per month but when we talk about canva the features it's offering in the free plan the crello does not have that much features in the free plan so now we know about the pricing let's check out these platforms now canva is super easy to use there are millions of templates available for you to choose from you can go with any of these templates and start your designing right now. Same on Crello, you can actually go ahead and select any of templates from hundreds of thousands of templates given. There are different categories that you choose from. Now, the good thing about Crello is that you can actually save high resolution images and presentations on Crello without any plan. Like if you are using the free plan, Crello will actually allow you to save high resolution images. But on Canva, that's not the point because on the free plan, you cannot actually save up very high resolution images and videos you'll actually have to you know there are many features that are locked that you need to buy a plan for and when we talk about the simple you know designing on both of these for example let's just go ahead and create a post on these and we'll learn about the features and we'll learn that how these platforms actually you know work so let's create a simple post on canva let's just select this one and i'll be creating a post here and also let's create a post on Crello as well uh, so I could show you that how you actually you know do that let's lift a template on here and I will be creating a post let's go with this one so what happens on both of these platforms is 
guys that on canva you can actually create your own logos you can create videos you can create presentations social media marketing and office work as well when we talk about crello you can do that as well on crello too you can make logos you can make videos animations and different designing tools as well so both of these platforms are actually you know head to head in creating different um designing and when it comes to the designing tool both of them are actually pretty amazing and allow you to create these amazing designs of your own so let's go to canva first so let me show you around canva is actually very easy to use and you get familiar with canva very easily once you start using it so this is actually a blank page and what i'm going to do is i can actually select any of these templates or if i want to start from the scratch i can do that as well so let's go with this one this is kind of like a christmas card i think yes it is but i can you know simply edit this one out so i will just simply zoom in a bit you can simply zoom from here and i will just simply zoom in a little so i can you know get with this easily so you can see right here this is the image on canva now what's going to happen is if i want to delete anything i can actually you know if i want to change this image i will simply click right here and added image and if i want to add another image in the background i can simply go ahead and change image if i want to edit this image i can edit it from right here if i want to make it smaller i will simply click and make it smaller if i want to edit any text i can simply go ahead and do that as well super easy to use and you can you know change the color of the backgrounds at any point if you want to i will just give it the same background color and i will just move this image back to size and we're just gonna keep it in the middle there you go and after that i can actually add different elements into my image this is where you know you learn that how you can actually create graphic designing on canva so let's just you know what let me remove these so i can actually show you how you do some of the elements how you add elements and it makes your picture look good you can just simply click and delete as well so now i have this simple background right so what i'm gonna do is let me add some elements into it let's add this person you can see right here i can add this guy right here let's add some of the more images let's add this element i can just make it smaller and i can change the image of this to maybe this and i'll just put it right here let's add another element into it maybe i'll just scroll down and let's add an image if we want to there are many free images available let's go with this free image you can just simply move any of the elements that you want to and then you can add them right here there you go if you want to add any text you will simply click on text and you can actually add a text subheading or a heading i am going with this one it is a text template that i will be using uh, but i will be changing the text so i'm just gonna remove this and i'm gonna say there you go once i have done this i will just simply you know make it a bit smaller so you can see right here that i have created this image just now in front of you this is how you create your design in canva so there are text templates there are different elements you can play with there are many fonts available and other options as well if you'll go to more you can actually add background shots folder audio video and different styles as well so this is how canva works if we go to crello right here you can see that i have actually selected a template on crello as well um so i'm just gonna make it a little bigger so we can get an idea so you can see that this image is right here and they have added all of these different elements into it and if i want to change the background what i will do is i can simply go to here and i can add filter to this background and change it the way i want to okay this one looks good if i want to add another text let's just say added this text right here and we're gonna say shopping let's just you know edit this one out you can see how this image has been created on a crello i can actually do a lot on crello as well if i want to add objects into my image i will simply click on objects and i can actually you know go ahead and add animated objects as well and other objects uh, let's add a star into it and let me show you okay you can see that this way i can add this animated sex kind of like thing here so what's gonna happen is i can actually change the color and let's make it pink i guess because it will match there you go let's add it here 
So once you click on something, you can see all of these different options right here. Let's go to the layering and bring it to a backward. I don't want it to be on the front. Yeah, bring backward actually. There you go. You can see now it's in the background. So this is how you actually added different images on Crello as well. And you can actually play around a lot. You will see all of these different options. Text option is given right here. If I want to add any text, if I want to add a video text, I can do that as well. Uh, so you can actually select any text template in here too, as I selected back there. So if I want to change the color of the text, uh, let's do that because we cannot see it here. So I'm just going to make it maybe okay this one looks good so i will select this text too and let's change the color there you go so you can see i have added this text right here if i want to select the overall text i can just simply you know manage it and bring it here and there you go so now you can see this is the image that has been created and it's actually a lot of elements into it so i'm just gonna you know uh, delete some of them so I can have a good image to show you that how it actually works. So you can see right here that this is how you add different elements into your video. You can add free images as well. If you will click on photos, you will actually see all of these free images that you can avail. So that's pretty good. And the image resolution is pretty good in Crello. You will see all of these different templates, different designs that you can choose from and create amazing designs on Crello. So yeah, when it comes to the designing, you can actually do very good designing on Canva and very good designing on Crello as well. Both of these platforms are very easy to use and they have free plans for you that you can actually avail. And these free plans have a lot of features to offer. So yeah, when it comes to if you are a graphic designer or a video editor or just looking for your presentation designing, then you should definitely check out Canva and Crello as well. So this brings us to the end of the video i hope that i was a big help to you and now you will be able to create awesome designs of your own make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to the youtube channel